Oh, no. No. This is not even close to a finished game, if you can call it a game. It's the worst game ever made, and I've played a lot. What is this, episode 118? So that is a big statement, but I'm dead fucking serious. It isn't as frustrating as Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. No, no, it's not as bad an experience as that, but in terms of functionality, this is an all-time low. There's credits, which suggest that actual human beings were behind this. More than one. What were they thinking? Why would anyone want their name on this thing? And did any single one of them look at this and think, maybe there's still some work left to do? Wouldn't there have been some kind of quality control? Even the worst games from the 70s had some playability, and it was rated by the ESRB. Somebody from the ESRB looked at this game and gave it a rating. I know it's not their job to judge the quality of the game, but somebody looked at it and thought, wow, this is shit. Imagine buying this game and you get this. It's like a cruel prank. They should have recalled this game and gave out refunds. Imagine advertising this sort of thing. Imagine putting a commercial on TV for this shitload of fuck. I wonder what it would have been like. Hmm. Hello? I got a little job for you, pal. They mess with me! They mess with the biggest boy in town! I'm glad to see things back the way they used to be. Well, that ought to put the coyote in the chicken coop, huh? Oh, yeah! And if he's ratting us out, kill him. It's easy. Haven't you ever seen a movie? You say it like it's a bad thing. Shut up, Carl! 